I had heard of De Maurier, believe it or not. <laughs> um, I hadn't heard of this particular film, but or this this novel. Um, but once I'd read the script, I was obviously very curious, and therefore then went on to read the novel, despite Roger Michel telling me not to. He told me to kind of focus on the story we were telling and not the source material, but I couldn't help myself. I still haven't watched the original film. Again, Roger, <laughs> to, to, to abide by Roger's wishes, um, he, he told me not to, I think he just didn't want me to kind of uh, take ideas or, or, or portray or do an imitation of someone else's interpretation. Um, and so for me, I, I approached this from specifically from, from Roger's sort of adaption and kind of built my character based on the knowledge that I had from the script. I definitely came up with a conclusion, you know, uh, I, I knew how I think it ended the second I read the script for the first time. And again, one thing Roger <laughs> insisted was that we never talk about the ending and we never talk about what we think. Um, I still to this day don't know what Rachel was playing. Um, I know what I was playing and I was playing it for real. I was playing the truth in each moment. and kind of exploring that relationship and, and the sort of uh, admiration that he had for her um, in each moment. So if there was a moment that I had to question her loyalty, then I would, que you know, I was questioning her loyalty. I think Rachel, uh, you know, I only got to know her through being on set, really, uh, and and she had this mysterious kind of, uh, I say darkness, darkness isn't the right word. Uh, she she kind of kept me on my toes. She really kind of kept me on the edge of my seat as an actress. Uh, she's so generous in the sense that she re approached rehearsals as well as, you know, filming as, as Rachel would almost and kind of wouldn't let me fully know exactly what she was gonna do and I think I was completely in awe of her. I, I, you know, even when from right at the beginning when we started reading through the script, you know, I, I wouldn't know how she was going to approach each moment, and she kind of kept me guessing. And I think I think that added to the mystery of of the relationship, and and definitely helped me in my performance. I think. I do think that me and Holiday working together inspired you know that that friendship at the same time she's such a good actress even if she actually hated me in real life i wouldn't know about it she she kind of serves us with a smile uh but she she is an incredible incredible soul and like an incredibly kind and and, and just generous as an actress and as a person she she's a friend uh, i'd like to think um yeah I, I i sort of always feel safe in in her hands I think the beautiful thing about how Roger has filmed this entire film is that it is left ambiguous. And the the final look that Holiday's character or Louise gives Philip is is kind of meant to leave for people, leave the audience kind of questioning what has happened, what really has happened. And I think, uh, yeah, I I, th I think hopefully people will be left asking questions and or wanting to talk about it or kind of uh, making decisions for themselves, but I, I wouldn't want to, to, to sort of put my, my, my thoughts on anyone else.